likely to find metal in these old trees. This is a farm. Yeah, true. Perfect. So we are going to, it's my turn. And here's my tree and I'm just gonna put it out on those logs and try not to mash the water. The water spigot, is that what it's called? put his drone up now and Joe will be getting into this tree next Okay. <laughs> he knocked the lid off with a branch. Put it back in. No insulation was harmed in the making of this video. That was dialed. Lid came off. No insulation was harmed. Joe's keeping his Christmas lights on. The stump cut all year long. So I figured I'd try to make it a juicy one. That's pretty juicy. Oh, I wanted to mention that uh, that clogger sent Damien these cloggers, and and so we want you guys to know that if Damien can put this tree, this half of the co-dominant, out here in the road, then uh, you should buy yourself some cloggers, cause it was all the pants what done it. Definitely recommended. They're comfortable. And if, and if he barber chairs this tree or, or <laughs> it don't go right, then don't get you any cloggers. Yeah. yeah. That's, the, uh, that's the only difference today, so. Yeah. yeah. If we have any issues, it's the pants. All right, carry on. Okay, same, this is Jeff Schroeder axe. If I can knock this wedge out, then you gotta get you one of these Schroeder axe builds. If not, then you probably should avoid them. There. Yeah, 
right on that. <laughs> thing you brought that. <laughs> He's coming out through here, but tons of weight this way. But again, the wind is pushing it this way, so it's like perfect. He has to hold wood this way, but it also leans so much. I mean, look at, I'll hold my hand straight. It has so much weight that way. I'd be cutting up this first and get it down into here. And then and save leaving that, leaving that back shop and then cutting all that off. Yeah. through here. That leans a lot this way. And the wind's pushing on it, yeah. Two septic lids right there. There's some power stuff in there, so we're gonna go. I think he's going for just the right hand side of the stick that's standing there. Oh, 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 oh. 
today. So here's the septic. I'll show you guys the cut. It was a, it was a hard leaner, so I went for a plunge cut. And it was a little stressful because the wind's pushing on it. And so it's nice to keep the hinge to fight the wind if you need it. But when you're plunge cutting, anyway, here's what the final cut looked like. Final cut. Pro. That's exactly what we were looking for there is he was plunging it. He bored us all the way through after his face was made. He left more on this side by checking both sides and knowing what was here and knowing what was there. And he bored out here and went to the other side, bored the other side out. And then this was the back strap that he released. And it actually pulled wood last second, the back strap. So that was pretty cool. Just to the right of both of those septic tank lids. Whoa, look, he's bucking. He's coming for you, Joe. That was his favorite tree. He owns this place. In local news, August Hunnicky was gored by a longhorn, or whatever that is. I don't see a big package hanging, so that's, that's a good sign. And the part where the guy's head, head turns into a skull for a second. <laughs> <laughs> From that meme I showed you. I thought of that meme. <laughs> 